Hey, welcome back to Triple R. Today we're going to take a look at the Boogeyman. So, soft steam. I got it for like a dollar. Looks like a dollar twenty-four. You can get the Boogeyman 1 and 2. Looks like for like a dollar eighty-six, I think, right now. So, I actually found kind of a scary game. You know, I've had a couple on the channel here. Not been very scary. Kind of boring, usually. So, this game is, uh, this, this is okay for what it is. So, the tutorial, tell you how to play the game. It can be VR or mouse or even, um, gamepad. Well, let's jump into a new game here. So I think he, I think he has survived like five nights. It's gonna give you some backstory here in a second. So the game is it's got some good jumps in it. So if you want to play it before watching this, if I would do that. To this, I sure hope you're not planning on sleeping in this room. I'm Alicia, and if you've unfortunately only stumbled across this tape during the dark, it's probably watching you right now. I left a flashlight under the bed if you've not already found it. It's the only thing they're scared of. I've, I've tried telling people, but the bogeyman, he got my sister. No one will believe me. They won't believe you either. Trust me, you'll need to learn to fight this by yourself. There are some spare batteries hidden under the floorboard, under the bed. They're kind of mixed up, sorry. If you can last long enough, it would leave you alone. Like it did me. Eventually. I hope. So I thought I could so let's go look under the bed and get your batteries here. It's not working. It's not good. Yeah, my flashlight's out. That's great. That's great. See, so yeah, I figure out where the boogeyman is coming from. Yeah, but this. Make sure you the spot him. Stupid. Everyone knows the boogeyman is scared of light. So if you ever get scared. Just shine your flashlight, okay? Thank you, Al. I'll sleep much better now. Just make sure not to fall asleep with it on, otherwise the battery will run out. So you gotta keep looking around. Make sure you don't sneak up on you. Oh, my batteries went out so quick on my flashlight. Oh, it's coming in the window. Yeah, this guy. All right. Yeah, you know, listen for like clues or cues. See where he's gonna come in at. They got me. So <laughs> that went rather quick. Going here, trying to grab some items here. Alicia, come on. You know we shouldn't be out of bed, Al. Mum and Dad will get angry again. Oh, stop being a baby. Now close your eyes and count to ten. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight, nine, ten. Yep. <laughs> this is a pretty good game. I don't know how many times you have to like discover them for the night to go through. I see ya. Still haven't got like how you get the batteries. They're supposed to roll under the bed, but I've got like none this time. I guess that's under the bed, I'm not sure. Oh, there's the boogeyman. They have one and two, I guess. This, I think this is part this is part one. Pretty cool. Alright, the good. Creepy, scary, cheap, easy gameplay. And for the bad, it can get repetitive. The controls are a little wonky at times. That's about it. I give the boogeyman a 7.5.